closed arena for the Sixers in Philadelphia was once again the focus this afternoon as residents gathered to hear more about how it may impact the community. The multi-million dollar plan has been a point of contention for months. Action News reporter Brianna Gallagher joins us live from Society Hill with details. Brianna. Yeah, Walter, it was a full house here at Mother Bethel Church here this afternoon. People wanted to make sure their voices were heard. Does the city of Philadelphia belong to the people or does it belong to the 76 of development? <laughs> More than 150 people gathered for an open discussion regarding the proposed 76ers arena in Center City, bordering Chinatown. We're smart enough to know that the essence of an arena is not what we want, so thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Many still have questions and are demanding answers. Our neighbors in Chinatown cannot uproot their community without compromising our very foundations. Councilmember Mark Squala was also in attendance. Having these type of meetings is so important because people's voices have to be heard in this process. As members of the community were able to be seen and to be heard and to ask the questions that needed answers. Um, and I think it was very effective. The development team for the proposed arena says the $1.5 billion project will bring more than $1 billion in new tax revenues for the city and 12,000 construction jobs. The group says they've already made some changes to the project based on community input. That includes adding 80 units of affordable housing. Now the plan is expected to revitalize Market East, specifically the fashion district. Community members today acknowledged they are 76ers fans. They just want the group to investigate other locations. Because I think a lot of people are Sixers fans and we would like to see them stay. But we don't want them to see them, we don't want to see them disrupt a vital community. Now, an impact study is currently in the works, and that's what a lot of people are waiting for. They're waiting to see those results and that data. That impact study should be complete by the beginning of the new year. We're live in Society Hill. Brianna Gallagher, Channel 6 Action News. Walter. Okay, Brianna, thank you. A very special.